you will get a penile block prior to the surgery that should persist in your immediate post-operative period. In addition, your pain will be managed with narcotic pain medicines as well as non-narcotic uh, steroidal anti-inflammatory medicines. After surgery, you will have a compressive dressing as well as a drain, both of which should help to reduce your post-operative swelling. Beyond that, you should take it easy, don't do any real strenuous physical activities, and keep everything clean. Keep the incision site clean and dry. You can shower, but do not take baths or soak the incision, and do not feel the need to scrub the incision either. You should start pulling down on the pump as soon as the day after surgery. This may be uncomfortable at first, but it's necessary to make sure that the pump stays exactly where we need it to be so that you can use the device easily once you've finished healing. Use your pain medicines sparingly and use the non-steroidal medicines such as Advil or Aleve as much as possible to reduce your pain. Also, you can use over-the-counter laxatives such as Miralax or stool softeners such as Colace to help avoid constipation. No heavy lifting greater than about 5 to 10 pounds for the first month after surgery. You can shower, but do not take tub baths or soak the incision until it is completely healed, likely up to a month after surgery. No strenuous physical activity for at least the first week or so after surgery, and try to keep everything dry as much as possible. You can drive as soon as you are off narcotics and your pain is controlled enough that you can compress the brakes when you need to without having terrible discomfort. In terms of returning to work, if you have a job that does not require a lot of strenuous physical activity, you can return to work likely after a two, your two-week follow-up appointment. If you need to have a lot of strenuous physical activity, it may be better to wait until four weeks after surgery. I would expect you to have one to two weeks of discomfort in the immediate post-operative period with pain that improves every day as you heal. You will see me for your two-week follow-up to make sure that everything looks okay. And then at four weeks to six weeks, depending on the recovery of your swelling, you should be able to be back having sex. Please call me if you have a fever greater than 101.5 degrees, if you have worsening redness or firmness around the incision or around the pump, worsening drainage of fluid that is solid colored and white, rather than clear drainage, or if you have any other concerns. If you are sent home from the hospital with a surgical drain in place, you should follow up three days after surgery for removal of the drain. Otherwise, you should follow up two weeks after surgery for your first post-operative appointment, and your following appointments will be made after that. Most people are able to use the device between four and six weeks after surgery, as soon as the swelling in the scrotum has decreased enough that they're able to comfortably pump and inflate the device. If you have any questions during recovery, please call our triage line and they will forward all of your concerns directly to me.